I can't believe we are now in the Amazon rainforest, the largest rainforest in the world. Yes, the Amazon rainforest is called the lungs of the earth, and it produces up to one third of the world's total oxygen production every year. According to the World Wildlife Fund, it is home to 10% of the world's species, with more than 2.5 million species of insects scattered throughout the forest, and other animals including about 1,300 species of birds, 3,000 species of fish, and about 430 species of mammals. Wow, but I see a lot of news reports about deforestation in the Amazon rainforest, which must have destroyed the Amazon rainforest ecosystem. I agree, overcutting leads to higher temperatures, less rainfall, and a lot of CO2 from the process of felling trees. You know, in just 10 years from 1990 to 2000, the area destroyed in the Amazon rainforest increased from 41.5 million hectares to 58.7 million hectares, and a 1996 report indicated that deforestation in the Amazon rainforest increased by 34% compared to 1992. Sadly, there is still massive deforestation going on until now. Are these logging activities carried out by the local government, or are they legal? According to a report by Brazilian environmental experts and university researchers, 94% of the Amazon rainforest deforestation in Brazil is considered illegal. However, I think it is also related to the management and policies of the local government. If the local government can increase the transparency of the law, increase the protection and supervision of forest areas, and impose severe penalties on illegal fellers may reduce the deforestation of the rainforest to some extent. Ah, uh, even now we have seen the disaster caused by destroying the natural environment, but there are still many people who destroy the environment for money. This is the problem. More and more countries have suffered from environmental problems caused by economic development, such as the photochemical smog incident in Los Angeles, the London smog incident, the Minamata disease incident in Japan, and the smog incident in China. But we never learn to learn from it, and history repeats itself. Now the Amazon rainforest is still being deforested, and the degradation of forests increases carbon dioxide emissions, which increases the degree of global warming, and causes more disasters. You know, the natural environment of the whole world is one. If the situation doesn't improve, I'm afraid none of us will be immune to its effects by then.